in your project, Medium Design, you not only talk how to actually uh, confront and reshape uh, the, the actual architectural space, but also somehow to confront uh, the power architecture that we face. So can you elaborate on this political aspect of Medium Design? It seems crucial um, uh, to be able to detect at, at the very least, <laughs> to be able to detect the way that power is already using uh, dispositional registers to accumulate more power. Even, even if one is not designing to gain some traction against that, it seems that it might be useful just to be able to detect it. My question is on, because you mentioned also this uh, uh, like natural substances in terms of, of being medium or being possible medium. So let's, let's imagine ocean being a medium. And how can we design ocean then? Medium design is meant to join my other colleagues, many of them in media, media studies, media theory, um, who are asking themselves how, how can we start to take on the extra responsibilities of thinking about atmospheres and digital ubiquity. They are thinking, well, we're not qualified, we're, we're media theorists. Um, uh, but they have also been thinking a lot about ideas like the sea and atmospheres and, and so on. Um, so in some ways, what I'm trying to do is model in space, use spatial models, to show quite practically how one can make these relationships.